U.S. jeweler Tiffany & Company is suing luxury goods giant LVMH for stalling over a takeover deal. Tiffany & Company announced that it has filed a lawsuit in the Court of Chancery of the State of Delaware against LVMH Moet Hennessy Louis Vuitton SC and related entities. The lawsuit relates to the November 24, 2019 merger agreement between Tiffany and LVMH providing for the acquisition of Tiffany by LVMH and seeks, among other things, an order requiring LVMH to abide by its contractual obligation under the merger agreement to complete the transaction on the agreed terms. The lawsuit not only makes clear that LVMH is in breach of its obligations relating to obtaining antitrust clearance, but also refutes LVMH's suggestions that it can avoid completing the acquisition by claiming Tiffany has undergone a material adverse effect or breached its obligations under the merger agreement, or that the transaction is in some way inconsistent with its patriotic duties as a French corporation. Tiffany added under the terms of the merger agreement, LVMH assumed all antitrust clearance risk and all financial risk related to adverse industry trends or economic conditions. In addition, LVMH is required to do everything necessary to secure all required regulatory clearances as promptly as practicable. LVMH said it had been requested by the French government to delay the takeover due to tariff threats from the US. LVMH which already owns about 75 brands including include Kenzo, Tag Heuer, Dom Perignon, Moet, and Chandon, and Christian Dior, said a succession of events which undermined the acquisition of Tiffany & Company had prompted the board to review the situation. It said the board had concluded it would be unable to complete the deal by the closing deadline of 24 November outlined in the 2019 merger agreement. 